Hey guys, it's vlog 10. Um, I can tell you that I went to Buffalo Wild Wings again. That was really fun. I did that today. Um, I would have to say yesterday was probably a really rough day. Um, got into an argument and I kind of stopped talking for a while. Um, it was just a stupid rant that I did. I don't really want to talk about it because it's so dumb. It's about editing a video. It's whatever. I don't even care anymore. Um, I did start editing videos again, but I just did it like once in a while, you know. Um, I don't know. Like, uh, I'll do it like once in a while when I'm like actually like in the mood to edit but I haven't really been in a mood because like so, doing other stuff um but anyway today I woke up at like 11 and I don't know like oh I've just been so tired I don't understand it's unbelievable I don't know I don't, I don't know but it's just stupid but <clears throat> um I don't know. I went to Buffalo Wild Wings this morning. I drove, as usual, because my friends are so fucking lazy. They're like, oh, I don't want to drive. I was like, fuck. Okay, then I'll drive. So I drove all the way to Buffalo Wild Wings, and they didn't really pay for, for gas. And, you know, I don't, I don't really care, but, um, all I do care is just, I wish they did. At least give me some money, but anyways, I ate a lot of. I ate so much there. Oh my god, I ate this pulled pork sandwich with fries, and then I asked with uh, for wedges too. And I was thinking of like potato wedges, and it wasn't potato wedges. It was just wedges, and uh, fuck, it's so good, but I'm so full. So I got home. I fell asleep for like three hours and I literally just woke up not too long ago, well five minutes ago, because my dad was banging on my door saying, are you going to eat dinner? I was like, uh, no. And then I was like, wait, I guess I'll eat so I don't have to get hungry later today. And so I ate a little bit and then I'm making this video. Um... Yeah, I have school soon. It's gonna suck. And I'm like not so, I'm not happy about it because we're supposed to have a month off, but we don't. <sighs> I'm so not ready for school. I'm so exhausted already. And uh I'm so yawning. Uh but <clears throat> I don't know, like all this stuff is too crazy right now. I'm just like trying to figure out what I'm doing with my life. Probably just gonna focus hardcore. And I don't think I'm just gonna. I think I'm just gonna stop looking for a girlfriend now. Again, probably like, yeah. I actually stopped looking for a girlfriend like until the girl messaged me. But and then we started talking, and then started. I think it did start off good. And then, when my studying started, it started to go really bad. I don't know, but that was just the studying part. So it just ended up going downhill even more. So, at that point, we we're just not talking much anymore. Because um, of this huge argument that we had. And I hate arguing. I really hate it. Because that's how you lose a lot of people from arguments. Sometimes you can gain the friendship from arguments, but sometimes people just don't come back after arguments. They kind of just drift away because they think this person's like absolutely the worst person ever. But hey, that's their opinion. I can be the worst person ever, and I, I completely understand it because. I've lost a lot of friends because of arguments. That's because I'm majority blunt. Um, 
I can tell you one story that, uh, can't see, sorry. Uh, there was this one time my friend was having relationship problems and he wanted to vent to me. And knowing me, I'm very straightforward, I'm very, I'm very blunt. I will say anything that comes to mind. Um, I don't really think about it, I just say it, like, right on. So, he was telling me, like, what should I do? I was like, dude, she cheated on you, and you still want to get back with her, even though she cheated on you, blah, blah, blah. And he's, he's like, yeah, but I love her. I was like, well, she cheated on you. What do you want from me? Like, I'm trying to tell you and help you out. Like, if you want to keep getting hurt, then go fucking do it. Go, go make yourself hurt or whatever, you know? Um, that's one of the stories that I had that I lost a friend because of that bluntness. And I found out from my other friend that he doesn't like me anymore because I'm completely blunt and straightforward. Yeah, it's completely fine with that. I'm, I'm fine with that because I don't really like to sugarcoat things. I'm really bad at it. Like, I don't know, there are times where I will, um, I, I rant online a lot because I feel like it's another source for me to rant to. I don't like annoying my friends about it. So I don't really go to my friends to rant because I don't want to bug them. And so I always rant on Tumblr. I don't really rant on Facebook because I have family on there and I want them to fucking know about it. I fucking hate it. Like, no way. Um, so I rant on Tumblr a lot and people read it a lot. Sometimes it can be a really big mistake to rant on Tumblr because my cousin actually found out about it and it was like... It's not lipstick, this is fucking chapstick. Because my lips are chapped as shit, I was looking at them. Anyways, um, my family, my cousin actually messaged me. And he's like, she's like, oh, I've been lurking your Tumblr, are you alright? I was like, oh man, I don't want to talk about this, this is weird. Because if I talk about my feelings on to my cousin, it will spread like a wildfire. If I told them I was depressed, they will fucking, they will just go crazy. And then they will like swarm me like a fucking fly. That is an annoying piece of shit. And I don't know. I just don't really talk about my feelings to my family anymore because it just ends up fucking spreading everywhere. Like, I don't know. It's just not my thing. That's why I always rant on the internet because I feel like it's safer to rant on the internet, but it's not. Because some bullies are out there gonna bully you, but you know I don't really care. If they can, if they want to troll, they can troll. Cause I can troll back. Cause I don't give a fuck. If they want to call me chainsaw, call them other things. I'll be like, that's cool, man. What are you, black? Okay. Boom. Drop the bomb. Oh, you're white. Cool. I don't give a fuck. Well, if they're white, I would say more shit to them. I don't want to. There's a lot of things you can say to white people. You can be like, oh, do you have a job? Oh, what job do you do? Oh, you work at McDonald's? Cool, I make more money than you. Oh, damn. What a bummer. What are you going to major in? Nothing? Oh, that makes you retarded. Okay. I mean, who cares? Oh, man, I'm already ranting. Fuck this. <laughs> Fuck you guys. Um, yeah, but... I don't, even, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. But... This is just, this is my day 10 vlog. I'm telling you what I did today, how I feel today, what I'm still thinking about, and what the fuck is going on. That's my life. Deal with it. God, this chapstick is like so moist. <laughs> my favorite word. Yeah, my favorite word's moist, by the way. I, I absolutely love the word. So, yeah, dog. Gangsta rap, motherfucker. Anyways, I think I'm done ranting for now. Um, I'll probably continue tomorrow after work. Uh, yeah, man. See you later, guys.